Hey everybody, welcome back to Extreme Heat Peak Reviews. Now today I'm reviewing a snack. Now I know it's not spicy, but it's still a snack and it's still worth reviewing. I'm currently rocking the Scoville Units merch t shirt and beanie hat available at Scoville Units. But back onto the products I'm reviewing. I'm reviewing these crispy crackled pork. Bites, hand cooked in Staffordshire, a deliciously seasoned, great taste. Pork rinds, seasoned pork rinds. Nice, cool paper bag. You don't see many scratchings these days come in a paper bag. I paid a princely sum, one pounds, in my local convenience store, which is an absolute bargain. Crack these open. Mmm, smell nice. Quite a seasoning on them. This is a 65 gram bag. Cool. It is made by Ray Gray Snacks Limited here in the UK. Let's give it a go. I'm a big fan of my pork scratchings. Nice colour, nice bit flat there. Hmm. Wow. The seasoning is bang on. The crunch is bang on. You know what? For one English pound, you are getting a quality product. They're nice and small, nice and manageable. I'm not breaking my teeth on these. I've broken my teeth on many of pork scratchings, but these are not. Now, I'm unaware of any other retailers around here selling these these were picked up from my local convenience store two doors down from me you get some weird unusual stuff in so i have no idea where else you could purchase these unless you come to leamington and you visit the shop i bought these from maybe you can get them there i can reassure you pepper pig was not harmed in the making of these So if you've got any young kids watching, Peppa Pig's still alive. She's not in a packet. Hmm. I could eat these all night. Would not be great at these right now. That's an ice cold beer. Because this is a puff snack, guaranteed a puff snack. Mm. A couple more pieces. That is quality, 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 quality. And you get that nice bit of soft fat, and then you've got the crunchy bit on the outside. That's what makes a scratching the scratching is that nice soft, soft bit on the inside edge. Mm -mm 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 -mm. That's enough of that. I'm going to save these for a beer a little bit later on. Now, please check out my sponsors, Black R Biltong, at blackrbiltong.co.uk for some great tasting biltong 
That's an unbelievable low prices between two pound and two pound fifty per fifty gram pouch of built on, which is a great price compared to what supermarkets sell. I've got some really amazing flavour as you can see from the list behind me. I've actually done quite a few of their built ons. I've had the chance to review them all, which is amazing. Also, remember to check out Henry's Hot Sauce at Flavour and Fire Instagram, Flavour and Fire Facebook, and Flavour and Fire Twitter. Some great tasting sauces and some great rubs. It's barbecue season, so get out there, spice up your barbecues. This is a limited edition sauce. I don't think you'll be making any more of these. Which is a Podfather hot sauce, wax sealed with red and silver wax. He's also the manufacturer behind the EHP Pepe's Dream sauce which was a collab I did with him a tribute to my grandfather who never, who told me never to give up on my dreams and always believe in my destiny so this was a sauce I had made as a tribute to him with Sean over for a flavour and fire but remember to also give my main man LG Lowndes a big thumbs up a share and a like at FML Gaming Community he's got some great content out at the moment got phasophobia he's got uh, VR gaming he's got all sorts on his channel so go check him out he's a big supporter of EHP my project manager so please show him some support but that's about it for now I'd like to just ask you to give me a big thumbs up say you enjoyed this video please share your friends and family that's smash that red button turn it great help me reach 200 subscribers where I'll be taking on something completely random from behind me May it be a sauce, may it be a snack, may it be something from the extreme shelf right behind me. Who knows, who knows, I might let you all pick. But for now, I've been Extreme Heat Peter. Thank you all for watching. I will see you in the next review video, which I have probably be a sauce. So I will catch you later. Bye.